The lack of special laws to stop stalkers in Scotland makes it more difficult for police to act swiftly. John Stirling remains a free man, free to plan his next move against Lisa Bankhead. I mean, I said this to the police, I said, I said, how far do I go? Do I, do I stop standing in front of windows? Do I stop coming to work? Um, am I safe in my car? Um, if he has a gun, I'm not really safe anywhere. Do I stand in front of my own window at home? Do I stand, do I, do I, how far do I take it? Do I live normally and, and hope that he doesn't want to air my brains at some point? While Lisa is doing her utmost to avoid her stalker, Beverly Nicholson has decided that her only option is confrontation. She's been driven to this by sighting her stalker in a local supermarket. I'd like to talk to him face to face and tell him in no uncertain terms there is no chance of a relationship between you and me. There is no chance of a friendship. It is never going to happen. I do not want you. I do not love you. And I really want you to leave me alone. Beverly is meeting her stalker on neutral territory. She's warned him that the meeting will be filmed by the BBC. Meetings like this are very rare and are considered inadvisable. But for Beverly, it's her last desperate measure to throw Tyrone off her track. Even though he is banned from seeing her, Tyrone will not get into trouble as Beverly has arranged the meeting. The reason I asked you to come is because mm -hmm. I need you to know what you're doing to me. I'm taking this conversation because I want to tell you that you have to leave me alone. I want no contact. I don't love you. I never, ever will love you. Baby, so you've got fantasies above your station. You really have. You really have. Well, if you're telling me that you don't love me and you don't care for me, then I'm really, really glad. And I hope you move on and leave me alone. I will do. Because that's what I want. This really is. This is all in your fucking head. You know it's not. It is, Ben. It really is in your fucking head. How can it be in my head after what those exactly. phone messages me, last what night? You made messages. What? You sent me Basically, I've got to, text messages. Not text messages. Uh, voicemail messages last night. Six. Prove it. Declaring your undying love. Prove it. Where's the messages? On my phone. I want to go. Yeah. Next message sent yesterday. Yesterday, at 23 hours. Ben, I do love you. You are amazing. 